Hello and welcome to Talk Mental Health. I'm Dr Beth Colby, a psychiatrist in London. Approximately two out of five people with Parkinson's disease will go on to develop psychotic symptoms. There are different reasons for this. First of all, the disease itself affects the brain, especially in people who have cognitive impairment or dementia caused by Parkinson's disease. Secondly, the drug levodopa used to treat bradykinesia or the slowness of movement in the disease can cause psychotic symptoms by increasing dopamine levels in the brain. And thirdly, some people also have coexistent medical problems such as infections or stroke. Some people with Parkinson's disease are more at risk of getting psychotic symptoms. Risk factors that increase the likelihood of psychosis include older age, severe or advanced disease, use of Parkinson's disease medication like levodopa, vision problems, sleep problems, dementia or memory problems, depression or other mood disorders. Now, how do you treat psychotic symptoms in somebody with Parkinson's disease? Because the usual treatments for psychosis can actually cause Parkinsonian-like symptoms, such as tremor, rigidity and slowness of movements. Most antipsychotic medication binds to the D2 or dopamine 2 receptors in the brain, causing a decrease in dopamine in the brain. First generation or typical antipsychotics bind more tightly to the D2 receptors than second generation or atypical antipsychotics. It is the decrease in dopamine of the brain that causes the Parkinsonian side effects. Therefore, this medication is unsuitable for treatment for psychosis and Parkinson's disease as it can make the Parkinson's disease worse. Therefore, these antipsychotics are unsuitable for treatment of psychosis in Parkinson's disease as they cause the motor or movement symptoms of Parkinson's disease to deteriorate. Now, the antipsychotic drug clozapine binds more strongly to D4 receptors than D2 receptors. It therefore has fewer Parkinsonian side effects than other antipsychotic medication. It is also a partial 5-HT1A agonist. This activates the receptor serotonin 1A and this also reduces extrapyramidal symptoms or Parkinsonian symptoms. Thus, for the reasons outlined, clozapine is the ideal drug for treating psychotic symptoms in Parkinson's disease, including hallucinations, delusions and thought disorder. Thank you for listening. Bye for now.